picked a nice day out. I'm over. I won't tell you exactly where, but I'm in East Tilbury. And I'm with my mate Nick Lay. There he is. And we're out for a bit of birding, a bit of bird watching. We're out over on the edge of the Thames. Uh, in my local sort of my local patch. And we're doing a bit of birding, a bit of wildlife watching. So we thought we'd take you along. So far we've seen uh, Chetties for you, Graham. Setties for me. We've seen a sedge warbler. We've heard reed warblers. We had a cuckoo fly over. There's a pheasant. <laughs> just on cue. But we're over here. It's a really rich, diverse area for wildlife along the Thames here. It's the um, silt pans and the salt marshes. We're going up on a Thames wall now, but um, it's absolutely lovely over here. It's quite a, there's a lot of pits, like gravel pits, extraction pits, and landfill sites over here that they've used along the years, which is just behind us, the landfill site. But, you know, when they fill them in, they generally leave them for a place for nature. So we thought we'd take you along and see what we can see, because hopefully today there'll be a few surprises pop up. You never know your luck. See you in a bit. of a lake there and there's Potchard over there just had a male swan come right up to us swifts over the lake absolutely beautiful there's another little pond there it's fabulous over here See my mate Desmond running down a running down the old track like a giraffe. <laughs> Lovely days. Yeah, it's beautiful over this bit. This estuarine mud flat habitat is just so rich. Absolutely stunning. And then you've got the the silt pan marshes. I don't know what that alarm is. But yeah, bird life over here is fantastic. It's really good. I keep walking, see what else we can see. Seen loads so far, it's fantastic.
So I just stand on the sea wall now. And over there, on the, where is it? That there, I've got some closer footage. There's some seals floating around. And Nick said what they do is they lay on the, uh, right on the edge of the mud at low tide, because they're lazy and they can't be able to move anywhere. And as the tide comes in, up they float and off they go. Absolutely fantastic. I've got some photographs and some footage I'll put up for you now. Really lovely reed bed in front of us. Here's Nick now. Yeah, really lovely reed bed in front of us. And it's full of reed warblers, you can hear them. If you watch my video with me and Graham, the last video I did, you can hear, you can hear it. We've just stopped, just photographing a little, uh, little coop, baby coop, and then Graham's going to like this one from Naturally Curious UK. We heard the grasshopper warbler. 
but uh, he's in here somewhere. Just heard it. And then two chaps are walking along the sea wall and they said, did you hear the grasshopper warbler? So it's always good to stop and chat to people, especially uh, if they've got a pair of binoculars around their neck. Bit of local intel is always a good thing. But yeah, grasshopper warbler. It's in here, we'll see if we can get it. I highly doubt it, but you never know. You probably hear it from here. Yeah. Right, that's us finished for the day. Hope you've enjoyed that little video. Me and Nick over there socially distancing. Zoning, light the fag up. And I'll stick Nick's uh, social media uh, information in the information below. Okay, so if you go into the little bit of blurb below the video now, you'll see his uh, Instagram account where you can see all these lovely photographs that he takes of the owls and the foxes and all that. So go and give that a look. Yeah, it's been a really good day today. We've seen loads of stuff, haven't we? We've just stood here and spoke to a chap who hopped over the same fence as we hopped over. And he's the um, reptile recorder. He's been doing a reptile survey on the land we've been on. Very interesting man. We've learnt quite a bit, quite a bit today. So it's, that's been really interesting. We've learnt a lot of each other. And yeah, it's been a really nice, nice day to be uh, walking around, seeing a bit of Nick's patch. Anyway, as I say, I hope you've enjoyed that the videos and the and the pictures and uh see you again soon all the best catch you later bye